My name is Bryce Sage, a filmmaker who's a little obsessed with science. Did you know that the raw honey of bees is actually a great source of all the bee complex vitamins? In other words, I like to wonder about things. We found that vitamin D actually activates a gene that converts tryptophan into serotonin. Okay, so what exactly does serotonin do? First, I wondered what really makes me gay. Like, why did this evolve to begin with? Flies in the face of evolution, doesn't it? It kind of does. Yeah. Where we measure a man's erections to different kinds of erotic stimuli. So it's kind of like a polygraph for your penis, then? Exactly. And are we sure this will be big enough? Um. If identical twins have identical DNA, shouldn't both twins be gay? Then I wondered, do we really need vitamins? Farmers are growing for size and for the beauty of the crops. But is bigger actually better? I've always assumed if I eat a healthy, balanced diet, I'll get everything I need in terms of essential vitamins and nutrients. Is it actually true if I don't take enough, I'll die? Why do you want to go through all this? I'm kind of really curious about the nature and nurture of what makes us who we are. What can all these home kits say about Bryce and his genetic makeup? Actually, if you look on both sides for you, you're doomed. I'm doomed. <laughs> <laughs> Lately, I've been wondering what makes us really tick. In my quest for answers, I'll become the human lab rat. We've been waiting for you. And I'll go wherever it takes. Vitamin D is critical to make serotonin, and serotonin makes you feel good. So this is the limbic system here. This is where we survive and reproduce. So you know genes play a role, but that doesn't do anything to solve the evolution right. problem. So we measure the effect of the environment on the DNA. And what's that called? That's called epigenetics. Three, two, one, Let's get this party started. The things I'll do for science!